Hi guys, this is X Retro with DC Direct. Full size Wonder Woman versus Hydra or Serpent Statue. It's based on art by Adam Hughes and it's sculpted by, um, oh, I forget his name, but um, they did a really good job, but I don't think it really looks too much like Adam Hughes art. Zoom up on the face here. So, um, yeah, she's really muscular. Maybe a little bit too muscular. The boots, though, they kind of look like Adam Hughes style boots with the folds and wrinkles. So the serpents or the hydra is very detailed, very cool. You see two heads at first, but actually there's another one down here. She already defeated this one. I don't know if he's knocked out or dead. Dead probably because of the tongue. Maybe it has some nice paint with the red. It's in the corset area. It's a metallic. Gold is obviously metallic too. Yeah, the face is kind of um, kind of too masculine, I think. But it's a really cool figure. It's one of the larger statues I have here too. The detail on the, these are pretty cool too, the Hydra. This came out in, I believe, 2004. So it's pretty old. You can see some details on the scaling. Lots of detail, lots of different paint colors for the Hydra, different tones. The rocks look really cool, the kind of purpley, pinkish gray color. The boots almost look like a almost like a latex style with the gloss paint. Turn this around. The back actually looks really nice. It's you know detailed and muscular, but it still looks pretty cool. Zoom out again. The Adam Hughes boots I was talking about. If anyone's fans, they kind of can recognize that. I also have the smaller version of this. I actually got the smaller version first, but I wasn't really happy with it. Um, didn't seem like um, it had as much detail. It's pretty much the same thing, but it's just a lot smaller and it lost some of the detail and I wanted to save it for the big one. So I'm glad I finally got to get this. You see she's just choking there with the imprints of her fingers and his throat. There's that guy again. The stars are pretty good. They're, I'm sure it's hand painted, but they must have used some sort of stencil for that. Uh, there's some, some mistakes there. With the blue there on the star and a little white, I don't know if that's a scratch or this is a white paint drop got there. But I really like it. The, the skin tone's really nice. It's a more of a tan version of Wonder Woman. Anyway guys, hope you like this. See you guys next time.